One law enforcement officer is among the few people to film an undeniable encounter with a UFO during a traffic stop in Nevada only to discover that the craft was piloted by two rather human-looking individuals. News.com has learned that said policeman was patrolling the so-called extraterrestrial highway, CR 375 near Area 51 when he spotted said craft. Just another day patrolling in Lincoln County on the extraterrestrial highway. The county sheriff's office in Nevada noted in a caption on Facebook alongside two photos of the encounter. This was not the first time the travelers, who are quickly achieving stellar status on social media, were stopped by the law. The observably earthbound spaceship was caught on body cam in Missouri on a busy highway. There, the officer, living up to his oath to perform his duty, asked the extraterrestrials who claimed to be from Indiana for a driver's license. After rummaging through a stack of memorabilia, one produced a card with the mugshot of an alien and the words Area 51. The officer, after reporting his ongoing interaction with a modified vehicle in the shape of a UFO looked at the card and said, where is your driver's license? To which the driver of the ovoid machine said right there, while pointing to said card. No it's not the officer retorted, while the second passenger in the unidentified driving object could be heard chuckling. When he, said officer, was able to get a license that was actually recognized by the Lincoln County Sheriff's Department, he asked do you have your insurance for this UFO? The answer to this was yes. However, the insurance papers presented were close to a decade old and the vehicle's license plates were expired. The officer also observed that said craft was traveling at a speed of 55 miles per hour before it was pulled over. He said, it's going to take a week to get, to Roswell for a UFO festival, to which came the reply, well I can hit the warp speed if you want me. This proposal was an obvious contravention of the local earthling laws, forcing the officer to prohibit it. Well, I wouldn't want you to do that. I want, don't, you to get a speeding, ticket. Later, Sheriff Adam Carnell with the Crawford County Sheriff's Department in Missouri was quoted saying, I've been doing this for 19 years, and that's the first occasion I've seen a vehicle like that traveling down the interstate. According to KRQE, the driver of the early model UFO, who for the duration of his journey appeared to have identified as an alien, goes by the name of Steve Anderson, 67, when disguised as a human. He claimed he owned 70 vehicles and that he served the Indiana Police Department and in the Vietnam War. Anderson has some hard rules to make his journeys in his rather inflexible UFO, relative to the capabilities observed in other UFO sightings, successful. They are, wear the alien glasses, have a ray gun for protection, and always act like an 8-year-old.